Hi there guys, welcome back to some more Super Tio Kart The Big 20. In the last episode what we did was we uh, beat the Star Cup. Now we're just going to beat the Special Cup. No problem, easy peasy every time. This isn't my fifth attempt trying to do it because I keep losing right at the end. Nope. And my recording is definitely not an hour and 14 minutes already. So essentially, this track is easy. You have to try to lose, pretty much. And Toad is the biggest piece of shit I've ever seen in my entire life and needs to never return to this mortal coil, so if I could just obliterate his face, that'd be great. Bowser's not much better, but at least he isn't Toad. We need some kind of anti-Toad missile. If you could give that to me, that'd be great. See what I get you. God damn it. Because I was technically in the wrong AI zone, the red shell was like, nah. Everything, I feel like everything's conspiring against me recently. Starker went great. Ever since then. Been nothing but heartbreak. Still going. I have pig headed as all shit, and I'll keep going until I win, no matter how long it takes me. But I really do want an anti toad missile, so if you could get that sorted out, that'd be great. I'm going slow on purpose to try and get items to kill Toad with. I just wanted to be fourth on the first race so he leaves me alone. Because rivalry, aka the AI that's better than all the other AI, is based on how far away from you they are. So if Toad comes fourth instead of second, then suddenly I haven't got much to worry about. Bomb Toad. He's only got back into third, and I bet he gets back into second before the end of the race too. So a cheating fuck. Yep. There we go. The only way to concretely kill an AI in this game is to do it right before the line on the final lap. So they haven't got time to catch up. But so here's uh, Cooper Circuit, or Cooper Beach 2. A particularly difficult track to win on. Because uh, you can't go very fast in the water. However, the level itself is actually fairly easy. The AI, the AI are all slow. I keep saying air, I, uh, as if it's one fucking word. But AI is two letters. It's hard to catch up once you make mistakes in this level. That's the only hard part. Well, this section of the AI oils. I keep doing it, look. I keep saying uh, uh, AI. The AI. The AI. You fucking stupid degenerate prick. The AI are all slow on the last section. I might be able to tell I'm not in the best of moods with myself right now because I keep doing stupid things and making things harder for myself than they need to be. The only trick I would say that there is on this level is not uh, drifting on these shallow bits because you just don't turn the way you expect to turn. It makes everything hard and awful. And the uh, computer component, AI, enemies do not struggle with the same problems you do. If you can get stars, they really help. Stars help because you can actually, for God's sake, Luigi, you cheat. 
because you can actually just go full speed in the shallow water, which makes life a lot easier. Mushrooms are good too, although not as good because there isn't really any places to use it. Not in a place that will save you a lot of time anyway. That's just rude. So what I really don't want to be doing is what I'm doing now, which is battling for fourth with Luigi instead of battling for first with Toad. Chasing people. Normal city either side. I kind of backed out because I didn't want to get hit by it. Oh, for God's sake. That's a restart. Don't fall in the deep water. The only rule, and I broke it. Literally the only rule in this track. Do not fall in the deep water because you will die. Since there are no diagonal pieces in this track, they're just tiles. So if you fall in the deep water tile, sorry, you're fucked. That's not Tio's fault, by the way. This is just me being angry because the game has not been very kind to me recently. hard to win. If you get back into a bad position though, it can actually make your life easier. So if I go into like, know, even second can be good, but I'd more like to get into eight. Yeah, thanks. Bowser the facilitator does it again. Right, because you have a feather. Okay, so feather, feather's not great. It works, but it's not what I want to be doing. I want to be using mushroom. Mushroom gods are overpowered on this track. And you should respect them as such, as the golden deities of justice that they are. This is what the feather can do for you. If you have enough speed, you can make it over that. And now I'm suddenly back in contention. However, the mushroom gods do something even better for me. If Bowser can leave me alone long enough to get it. 
Oh, really? I'm making it harder on myself than I need to. And the game is not rewarding me for my stupidity. Fun fact, you can actually catch up to the AI here. It's all really slow on this final corner. For some reason. Mushrooms, please. The game is being a cruel bitch. As you can see, I am actually catching up to them on this final bit. Nothing. Right, I'll take third. That's all I'm going to get. Unless I can sneak past Bowser on the final bit. See you. Okay, second place, I'll take it. Prot was actually a pretty bad attempt at this track with no mushroom gods. I'll, uh, I'll take it. So I'm still ahead. Now, fun fact, the best I've ever done on this track in 150cc is 4. Because this track is annoying. The final straight, the AI will go faster than you can physically go without a mushroom. Their speed stat is too high on that final straight. If you want the whole track, they're pretty good. Also, I just got a feather for the first time in Earth's history on this circuit, so that's pretty sweet. But they, they all go faster than me here. Besides, maybe like obviously the the lower ranked people, which never go faster than you do. Only one place to use this feather. But you'll see them really quickly catch up to me on the final straight. Pretty much this last section here is the only place in which I'm quicker. As you may have already been able to tell. Sorry, Weech. You're not my intended target. Just to let you know. I'm like barely keeping them at bay right now. And I mean barely. games make me look like a liar. But trust me, they are faster than you are. <laughs> Luckily I got away with it. Phew. Okay, so this is free. I can't lose now. Uh, Rainbow Road is actually the easiest track of all time. In this hack. Because uh, it's not very complex. There's no big holes. Every line is very clearly defined. Every, uh, Pitfall is nice and telegraphed, so it's kind of hard to mess up. Right. We need to do is bully a toad and say, see you later on the finish line as we cruise off to victory makes me very happy because this has been an hour and a half of pain. Thank you. 
Thank you for the win. That was four firsts in a second in the end. That was actually really good. Jesus Christ. Okay. Could I have my trophy, please? And never talk to me again. Thank you. Right. He's done it. Congratulations, excellent driving, you're now a Super Mario Kart expert! Uh, I'm going to save you the trouble of watching all this again. Can I fast forward on this? Have I got a fast forward? Let me check. Speed. Fast forward, tab. Here we go. Thank you! Goodbye.